Hey guys, what's up? Jed here. Welcome to another video. I hope you're all having a great day. In today's lesson, we're going to be learning how to expand single brackets. So here we have an example of a single bracket. And let me just explain what's happening here. You have a two on the outside. And what this two is doing is it's multiplying by everything inside of the bracket. So in this case, in order to expand the bracket, you have to multiply the two onto everything within the bracket. And this is what it looks like. Two multiplied by X gives us two X. And I write that without any brackets. And then positive two multiplied by positive three, which gives us positive six. And there you have it. You've expanded the bracket for this example. Okay, now let's take a look at this example. Here we have a single bracket and a couple of other terms in this expression. How would you do this? Well, outside of the bracket, you have a negative three. Yes, that's right, a negative three. You should always include the symbol on the number that is outside of the bracket. So first things first, I'd write down the two as it is, and then I would proceed to multiply this negative three into each term inside the bracket. So we're gonna have negative three multiplied by X, which gives us negative three X. And we're gonna have negative three multiplied by negative four, which gives us plus 12. You must always simplify expressions where possible. In this case, we're gonna have two, add 12, which gives us 14, and then minus the three X left over. And this is your simplified expression. This is a very interesting example. If you have just a single minus or negative symbol outside of a single bracket, what you're actually looking at is a minus one. Now we don't write the one for the same reason that we don't write a one if you have an X on its own. We don't need to say one X, we just say X. So if you just have a minus operation outside of a single bracket, this is how you can expand it. You apply the minus symbol to each term inside the bracket. So here a negative one or a negative multiplied by a positive gives us a negative. So we end up with negative two here and a negative multiplied by a negative. Don't forget that the symbol to the left of the term belongs to that term. So a negative multiplied by a negative will give us a positive. So this ends up being plus X. And although this is the correct expression, I prefer to write my final expression with the positive X first and the negative next. So this is gonna look like X minus two. Notice that when you have an X that's positive at the front, you don't really need to write the positive symbol. This is absolutely fine. And I'd prefer to leave my final expression like this. Now we look at an example where you have three terms with inside the bracket, but this will work just as expected. The term outside of the bracket will be multiplied to each term within the bracket. So here we end up with two X multiplied by X squared, which gives us two X cubed minus, 2x multiplied by y, which gives us 2xy. And finally, 2x multiplied by 2, which gives us 4x. And that's the final expression. In our final example, we have two single brackets separated by a minus operation. How you'd expand this is you would do each single bracket separately. So I'm going to have 2 multiplied by x and 2 multiplied by negative 3. This is going to give me 2x minus six. I will then expand this minus operation into the remaining single bracket. So a negative multiplied by a positive will give me a negative. This will be minus X. And the negative multiplied by negative will just give me a positive plus two. Now, if we simplify this by collecting like terms, we have a two X here and the minus X here. Two X minus X leaves us just with X. And then we have minus six plus two, which gives us minus four. And there's the final expression. And that's it for expanding single brackets, guys. I hope you've learned something by watching this video. If you have any questions, please just leave them in the comments below. Thank you and take care.